This is also a moment of joy and satisfaction for your families and friends, guardians and mentors who have been of immense support in your journey. I congratulate all the degree recipients and model winners present here today. I am told that out of 7,116 students studying here, about 1,518, that is about 21% are girl students. I noticed that out of seven gold medals today, three have gone in to our girl students. As the President of India, I happen to be the visitor of about 150 central institutions. In most of the convocations I attend across the country, I notice that our girls are out signing our voice and winning more gold medals in liberal arts, humanities, medical sciences, law and several other areas. This is indeed a heartening trend and reflect the potential of our daughters. However, it has been observed that the enrollment of women in technical and scientific disciplines is low. According to a recent survey, enrollment of women in engineering and, techno and technical institutes across India is only about 20%. Our girls should be encouraged to pursue technical education and excel in the same manner as they do in other areas. The country needs more of our girls to pursue higher education, especially in science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. Growth and excellence of women in technical areas will add a new dimension to our national development. It will promote gender empowerment at the higher levels in the field of science and technology. It will help women break the glass ceiling in one of the most important spheres in the world of 21st century. 